Hello YouTube fans, here again. As you know, it's my day off, so I figure why not? Why not? Peter News. That's right, Peter News. Not done it for a while, why not? Things to come and things I'm thinking of doing. Why not? Now, we'll talk a bit about politics because it will come before we get to do, 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 the 19th. Night Freedom. You already know what I think about that after the rant I had earlier on. <laughs> but so you already know what I think about that. That other thing. Let me think. Oh, yeah, yeah. How could I get this one? How could you forget this one? Bear with me. I've got one of these. I can fucking find it. Where the fuck is it? I probably can't fucking find it. I'm gonna need one of these fucking things. It's in here somewhere. So much shit in here. Oh, here it is. Don't leave home without it. Yeah. If anyone wants to go to the pub, well, not the pub, but I like that at the moment, but offence there. Eh? Anyone wants to go to the cinema? Anyone wants to go to a theatre? Anyone wants to go to a nightclub? You're gonna need one of these. You don't need one of these. What's next? We're going to have to have a blood test. We're going to have a perm a bloom sample. And we're going to have a piss sample to make sure we haven't got it in our pee. Seriously, what the fuck next do we need? Fucking mad. Why not fucking tattoo it on our forehead and say we haven't got it? So, yeah, that's something else I forgot to say in the rant. But, enough of that, I thought I'd say... You know, it was my day off today. I did sort of pop in and say goodbye to one of our lads. We've got a long lad called Joss, right? And he's leaving us tomorrow. Tomorrow's going to be his last day. So if Joss is there and he's watching YouTube, Joss, my friend, I'm going to miss you. Nice lad, good lad. Very hard working, very nice, very kind. Good, good sense of humour. I'm going to miss him. I'm going to miss Joss. He's a nice lad. So, it's not a sad bit of news, but he's a good lad. Hopefully he'll fish at us. And, as you know, I've got a lot of sad news about Richard Donner. Remember I said about Richard Donner and how he sadly passed away? Director, as I say, did a lot of good films. I think about reviewing his films. I've done them before. You know, I've reviewed the original Lethal Weapon. I've reviewed the sequels, whether it's Lethal Weapon 2, Lethal Weapon 3. I was half and half about Lethal Weapon because it's not one of my favourites because it's Richard Donner I'll do it but word of warning it will probably be a review and a rant because I'm going to love the fourth Lethal Weapon film but I'll do it it's due I'll do it it's due I'll be lenient because the TV series sucks fucking ass but again it wasn't done by Richard Donner so that one I probably do films I do like of Richard Donner. Like, I like Lethal Weapon. The first one I love. The second one is a damn good unestimated sequel. And the third one, a damn good film. So I've ended like that. I also do The Doonies. I like The Doonies. Kids at Fencer film. Like it. Why not? Why not? I'll do one called Lady Ark. I never knew that. And I got the film. And I love the film. Film called Lady Ark. It's sort of an offensive. We're going into it like a buccaneer, sword fighting, and monsters and stuff like that. You've got to be more disappointed because it's more of a love story. But Wooded Hour, how I miss Wooded Hour. Another day I might do a chip up to Wooded Hour. And myself Pfeiffer, I've got to admit, myself Pfeiffer in this looks fucking damn beautiful. Even though she had short hair as she did this, even with short hair, even with short hair, she looks bloody beautiful. That being the beautiful myself, I've had myself five foot and Woods Hour in them two films. To death or is a delight. It's a fucking delight. So, yep, Richard Donner, I'll do that one. I'll do Superman the Mover, the original. I'll probably do another job of it. Da -da -da -da, because it's Richard Donner. I'll probably talk about the netted versions of it. Why not? Because it's a hell of a lot better than the fucking last one. The last one in my eyes. The test for shit. Superman thought the test for shit. Could fight in its own fucking dump. Damn same. Damn same. The test for read the last performance of Superman and it fires all over a pile of shit. However, the one with Richard Donner, the original, the classic, that being Superman, da, 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 the mover, it's a dudden. I might include the film that started his career off. 
Now, Tan is a not as much of a lover of it as I am on the sequel. I'm just more of a lover of the second one, that being Omens to Damien. And the third one, I offended it. A lot of people shit on that one, but I don't think it's a bad one. Fourth one, you know, I don't know what I think of it, but I'll do it its fucking do. I don't love it, but I respect it. I do think it's a dud film. you got dud, competent actors. Do you want to see with Tom Patterson? What's with Tom Patterson? Go to the 1996, The Omen, right? Was it 96? Yeah, 96. We might have won on that, right? And, uh, or was it 2006 or whatever, right? We go to the 2006, The Omen. Why not? I'm on a roll. Go to that one, right? I think it was 96. Can't be hard thinking about it now. And um, where you've got actors at the back of me, that's an insult. But that back of me, fuck it, why not? I'm on a roll. Piece of fucking wood. Then you go to the tacit 1976 one. There, I won't forget, damned up there. Um, where you've got dud actors, you know, you've got dud actors. You've got Dr. New Star himself, Patsy Talton, as a far for. You've got fucking, you know, Ted the Peck, Lee Remick. The this goes on. Dud actors, I say it again, dud competent actors. Now, normally, Richard Donham is going to do a lot of film. It is a lot of film. And he was going to take a chance on this one. It was like trolls and goblins and monsters. He didn't want to do that. He didn't want to do that. He wanted to make it psychological. He wanted to make it expenseful. And he did do. And he made a dud -un. You want to see the difference in one done the shit way? What's the fucking remake? It is fucking horrendous. It is a fucking pile of fucking shit. We have seen the rant. The original old moon, however, it's a tacit. It's a tacit. It's a hell of a lot better than the remake. So I respect that one. So for a typical to Richard Donner, because I do watch the Richard Donner films, you know, I do what watch them, whether it be the original Lethal Weapon, whether it be the original Omen, whether it be the original Superman the Mover, whether it be the Doonies. I do what watch them then. You know, oh, and I can forget, I might even do Stoods. Stoods, I think I've done it before. Stoods with Bill Murray. Can't stand Bill Murray in, in real life. I think he's an adequate fucking prick. But I do like the film. I like the film, Stude. It's a different take on it. It was different, it was new, and it was professing for its time. So, yeah, why not? So, for, the, for people like Richard Donner, for respect, and he's no longer with us, I'll do that. I might even talk a bit about Sue Macor. No, I admit that I was shitty on these two Batman films, as I like to call the Buttman films. Right? But there are some films I do like of Schumacher. I admitted that. Fall Down. Damn Dud Unestimated Film with Michael Douglas. The Lost Boys. I reviewed it before. I like The Lost Boys. Another Damn Dud film. So not all these films suck. The only two I didn't like was fucking Buttman and Throbbing. And Buttman sucks for effort. But. I don't always like him in real life. I've heard a lot of rumours that he was arrogant and he was cocky, but I'm not going to speak to all the dead. He's no longer with us, and I'm not a fire on the wall, right? But like I say, there's some films I like. So I'm going to do The Rise and The Falls of Sumaco. I'm going to say all in one what I like of his films and the ones that I thought was a piece of fucking shit, which you already know what that's going to be. And uh, I'm going to talk about Batman, the third one again, but what the story was originally was going to be about. Rumours, I've heard what the film was going to be about. I will only see that one. And then I'm going to talk about the Schumacher films I like. I'll just say it again. The Lost Boys, Fall Down, to repeat myself. So I'll probably talk about that. But before a bit more politics on the way. Now I'm going to die and dodge politics. That's why for a bit, if you've not noticed, I've been talking more about films. Because politicians all talk out the fucking ass. It's like Boris Johnson going on about, Oh, yeah, 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 you're the Walmart for the people to get their freedom. And then the next week he's doing what the scientists want. Fucking have me and the fan, wherever the fuck is it? I saw it again. I'm on a fucking roll. Why not? Why not? 
me I'm not one of these every time I want to have a drink with me fucking friend. Me, I'm not the app on my phone and put it on the fucking thing just to solve that. I've been in the track and chase thing. You know, it's just baloney now. It's baloney. An illness where it's more deadly for old people. An illness where it's more deadly if you've got elf issues or if you're a fat fuck. You know what I mean? I know I'm not being horrible, but I'm being a realist. I'm being a realist. Shoot me. And that's what it is, and it's over fucking height. It's an illness now, what should be fucking fingered. And not, I can tell you, I'm landing out of the damn puss under the lockdown. Not by this fucking bullshitty that September is going to be the end. I can tell you, I'm landing out. I'm, I'm a fucking psychic. Boris Johnson will fucking find some excuse. Don't buy it for use, because it ain't. Because it was something a fucking long time ago now. Don't buy it for the NHS, if that's the. If that's the taste, why is the Nightingale is still a sucked down building? So let somebody fucking have a go at me on that fucking one. So yeah, I will have a go at Boris Blumley Johnson. I'd respect for him, and you already know with the EU, but my respect went out of the fucking window after this shite. Anyway, to talk the show this out, I'll probably talk about other things as well. I'll probably talk about blah, 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 blah. let me think. I'll probably tie on with the man myself films, as you can see. The man myself films that it got to the later ones, as you found out when I did the fifth one and the next ones, are a piece of fucking shit. But I'll talk about the last ones, why not? Get it over and done with. And then think of other things on the way. Until then, people, be smart, be safe. And I'll see you soon for some more of Peter News and things to come.